All right, this is Josh Journey, uh, Darkness Totems, being played on Nintendo Switch, courtesy of Cupid Interactive. Uh, just hit play here. Okay, so this is actually a pretty awesome uh, 2D side scrolling brawler. So we've got Josh, Molina, uh, Farquhar, and ZOZ. Now, you're choosing the order of characters. I'm going to go ahead and just pick an order. And this is the main the main map area, so you can go ahead and hit ZR to head into the sanctuary. And this is kind of like your hub area. This is where you're going to respawn when you die. And this will let you um, heal your characters. So it'll let you um, upgrade your abilities. And it'll let you practice new moves. So you're, you're here, go to the computer, you can hit B. And if you had enough orbs, you can unlock um, various abilities for your character, which is kind of cool. And then here you can heal yourself if you need to. And here you can practice on the uh, on the robot, or you can go back to the map. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and do the starting area. It's not very far into the game, but that's okay. I just wanted to show you kind of the how the game starts out. So I love the artwork. Their style is amazing. Um, very cartoony, <laughs> very, uh, very just awesome looking. Um, very, and it's that's HD, which is nice. It's not pixelated. Now you've got the uh, Y button for your uh, light attack. You have X for strong attack, B to jump, and then you have A for a special attack. But you kill enemies. And you gain orbs from them, which can be used again to upgrade your characters. Now, what's cool is you can you can end up switching characters on the fly, so you can like literally hit the uh, L and R buttons to swap characters in the middle of fighting, which is nice. And the more characters you, the more. Um, The more enemies you defeat, um, the higher your uh, your special ability bar gets, and you can use special ability, which is the A button. But your goal is to get through each province, and. Um, Defeat the or uh, destroy the uh, totems. Okay, so Josh is down. So I can go ahead and use uh, Farquhar or any of the other characters to kill the enemies on the screen, and then I can use the masks to revive the character. I'm gonna go ahead and do that. So I'm gonna hit B, and that'll bring the character back, which is kind of nice. Um, every character has their own special ability, which is nice. I love how quick the combat is. I love how different all the characters are uh, with their uh, attacks. I love how you have two different ranged uh, characters and then two uh, close quarters. And this and this can be played with uh, multiple players, which is nice. 
It supports at least two players. They might actually support all four. Which is kind of cool. You, ha you also have um, uh, uh, ultimate items you can get. Which is kind of cool. And those are achievements which I really like. Okay, we're gonna go to the next area. Feather Village, where the mayor runs away. <laughs> There's the mayor. He's running away. Mark Cardell. Please don't worry, just defend our province from the invasion of these monsters. I can't stay here and watch my village being destroyed. I'll find a safer shelter. Good luck. <sighs> what a coward. I really like the uh, uh, enemy variety. is kind of uh, kind of cool. And yeah, I mean, if you guys like Castle Crashers or Scott Pilgrim, you guys are gonna find a lot to like with this one. Still has its own unique charm, but at the same time, being a great, great brawler. This game would have would be a lot easier with uh, two players, but it's not too difficult playing single player at all. You have a collect an ultimate item using extreme combat situations. So I'm going to hit uh, Y and B. kind of cool. So every every character is going to have their own ultimate uh, attack, which is kind of cool. Here's the evil building here to destroy. This is introducing you to uh, aerial enemies. In this case, aerial um, eyeballs. <laughs> evil buildings. The guy is definitely easier to kill uh, playing with either Josh or uh, Farkle. Just because you can land the um, heavy attack, which you can't with uh, as he as he. How about we turn around? There we go. And ZOZ is gone. And Josh is gone. This is awesome. And the other one's almost dead too. And they're all gone. <laughs> I kind of figured this could happen. I should have should have ran away. But now you're gonna end up in the uh, sanctuary here, and you can heal your your party. So 
so yeah, definitely, uh, oh, we can, oh, no, we can't. Okay, right, guys, so let's been a look at, um, a very awesome platform. This is Josh Journey, uh, Darkness Totems. This is a great game, definitely one I'd recommend if you like Brawlers. Um, you like Castle Crashers, uh, Scott, Scott Pilgrim, pick this game up. It's a great game. I want to thank you, Ride Interactive, for the very opportunity. I want to thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. And as always, until next time, take care and happy gaming.